What is Interact? Interact is a humanities-based workshop series offered free to elementary schools, middle schools and high schools in Northern Nevada and California from the beginning of February to the end of May. These fun and interactive workshops teach students about the characters, themes and language of Shakespeare's plays, as well as fun theatre games. <laughs> the instructors Seasoned theatre professionals and experienced teachers bring Shakespeare's plays to life in fun scene study classes with the students playing the roles for themselves. She's speaking! Yes! Oh, speak again, bright angel, so that his first lines but soft will light through yonder window breaks. It is the eastern, he's saying, oh! He's not expecting Juliet to come out. He doesn't really know that she's going to come out there. She's like, oh, Juliet's come out onto the balcony. She's, oh, she's so beautiful. She's so wonderful. And she comes out, and then she says, I mean, he's like, oh, she's going to say something. She's going to say something. What's she going to say? Keep talking. Say something about me. Say something about me. That's what he's thinking. Fall that I, one snout by name, present a wall. And I such a wall as I would have you think that had in it, in it a crannied hole or cheek. There's something about Shakespeare that takes teenagers out of their element and transports them back to a time where prose and poetry ruled. These are kids who usually bond with video games and text messages. Um, I guess it's a teenage thing. <laughs> it's what we all do now. I guess everyone has a cell phone. Interact teaches kids not only about Shakespeare, but about the importance of history and the arts. What do the students learn? He meant a lot of uh, English words, a lot of vocabulary. He, the way he talked was very different from the way we talk nowadays. Oh, night! Oh, night! Alack! Wait, how do you say a lack? That's right, that's right. Oh. A lack, a lack, a lack. A lack, a lack, a lack. On a more human level, it, it teaches them uh, communication, uh, empathy, which I think is a really underestimated uh, skill to have. The ability to step into somebody else's shoes and see the world from somebody else's perspective. And it's fun without electronics. One, two, three. Down with the Capulets! Down with the Montagues! Down with the Capulets! Zach, tell me one thing that you learned working with Joe on Shakespeare last week. Well, that uh, Nick Bottom is, thinks that he's really, really good stuff when he's not that good of an actor. Yeah, was Bottom your favorite part to play? No, my favorite part was in Romeo and Juliet. Or, yeah, Romeo and Juliet. It was Abraham when I got to bite my thumb at Samuel. But I really want to be Tibble. Okay, why do you want to be Tibble? Uh, I don't really know. What kind of a guy is Tibble? Oh, uh, really mean. Yeah? Do you think that would be fun to play as an actor? Yeah. My name is Alexis, and I'm eight years old. Alexis, tell me one thing that you learned about Shakespeare last week. Um, he's like a really good writer, and um, I didn't know he wrote all those plays. Do you have a favorite Shakespeare play? Midsummer Night's Dream. Why is that one your favorite? Because there's a lot of characters and lots of magic. Excellent. Tell me one thing that you learned about acting this week. Um, that you can't be shy, you have to just be bold. What are the benefits of Interact? There are so many beneficial parts. Um, First of all, he's really good with the kids, so he, the kids love him and will do whatever, whatever he suggests to them. Uh, but I think probably the most beneficial part is that the students, I, I believe, get a real love and feel for Shakespeare and for the language of Shakespeare and um, the, the plays, getting to know the plays and just realizing it's just real life. You know, well, not all the killing, but <laughs> hopefully. <laughs> hopefully. <laughs> but I mean, it's just based on, you know, something that's happened. And I think that's going to go into their writing and help them with their writing and obviously with their history that we've been studying about Shakespeare. So all around and plus building self-confidence. 
in themselves, hopefully, and trying to get them.